what's going on, family? It's your boy, Mr. P, and welcome to another episode of Sunday Morning Markups. Hope everyone had a phenomenal week. If you guys have not yet locked in with our platform, please go to pimpinaineasy.com. All right. Join our free profit channel. Also, feel free to get funded with Sway Funded. Subscribe to our YouTube page and lock in with the best broker in the game. Sway Markets. Also, if you have not seen this boot camp, it's on YouTube. All episodes are out, so make sure you lock in, family. All right. Go went crazy last week. It dropped after been buying up crazy. So I do like this zone here. This whole zone. It has to break this zone in order for us to continue to sell. Right, the weekly looks crazy with the pullback. I would love to see price come back down here somewhere, but right now, this weekly hasn't really touched any type of structure. It's literally been buying. This was the last kind of structure we had at 2156. So, not sure if it's coming back down to 2091, but we are officially looking for sales. All right, now this four hour look promising. So price could come back up to this zone. All right, this four hour zone we got here. Just make sure I alert is on. All right, so we have this four hour zone here. I do like this zone. Now, I don't know if price is coming back up there, but it will be nice if it did. It would be nice, family. It would be nice. So if we can catch something like that <clears throat> for the continuation. Or well, we may get this. We may get price coming to play in this area. We get the other potential shoulder, right? Just to make it simple, something like this. <clears throat> right? Price may play in this zone for a minute, you know, kind of like it did over here. And then create this, this other shoulder, you know. That would be nice too. <clears throat> but I would love to see this order block get hit. So we're just going to wait on price to come to us and see if we can get that play. But if it breaks this structure, we'll get in on the retest, all right? I would love to see go come down to about... 22, 2300 right up in this zone. That's why I want to see gold come in touch. But we may get the pullback. Let's see how the market opens on tomorrow. We did have buys on AU, right? It worked out, hit our second TV, and then price came tanking. This white line is another level of structure, but we're just going to see how the market opens when it comes to these USD pairs because they went crazy last week. All right. So this is my, one of my bids, ACAD. So I do want to see ACAD come back down and touch this zone here. So I would love to see that. Price did come up to our zone, played out exactly how we wanted it. Except on our buy, we got spiked out, but we did catch uh, we did catch some pips off of this. All right, last week we didn't catch this sale, but it do looks like it do look like it want to continue to the downside on AU. All right, so we did catch this play on CJ, and it went crazy. As you can see, a little pullback. Uh, 20 pips stop loss for 100 pips. TP smack. That was good. Would love to see price come back up to the zone. This engulfing zone because it hasn't made. All right, this is the last high as far as body goes. This right here. It took out the high and created this high. So this was the last high. Price came and respect the zone and dropped. I would love to see price come back up here and maybe continue. 
something like that. Then to the continuation, that would be nice. So we're gonna see how that looks for CJ. Easy D Cat, man. Easy D Cat. I love Easy D Cat. Because we've been in this thing for a minute. Look like you want to create an inverted head and shoulder. But we'll see. We'll see if Price Respect is on here. We'll see if Price Respects that. We could potentially get the continuation. But this is a zone up here we like. And a real nice zone, too, if it's on here. I think it's on the four hour. But yeah, this is our thoughts on EZD. Played out nicely. It didn't kind of touch this, but it did, you know, do what we thought it was going to do. All right. Euro GBP. Euro GBP bought up last week. All right, so we're well, sold down. Excuse me. But the week before that, we caught this buy up. Hit our two TPs. And now... Price is uh, kind of in a standstill. I would love to see it come touch this train, right? That would be phenomenal. But you know the market likes to do liquidity grabs. So you may come fill this gap here. It's a gap right here in this yellow zone. Price may just come fill that, so. But we're waiting on price to break this consolidation. All right. See this weekly consolidation? We love price to break it and retest. Something like this right here. You know, break, retest, continuation. Because it's, um, it's been consolidating, but these are good gains here. All right. US 30 been doing the drizzy. We caught this sale, but I do expect it to go back up and then drop. I want to see price come back up into this zone. Is that a wick? Oh, we can look in here. Yeah. Be nice. We can get price to come back up there. That would be nice, but it did break nice level here. <clears throat> so with US 30, I think I want to see it buy up before it continue to fall, but that is a hard fall. So just be on the lookout for pullbacks. USD Mexico finally wants to buy up. We hit our first TP a few weeks ago, and this last week just closed bullish. So we we'll just we'll just wait that out and see how that plays out. But my honest opinion is the market did a lot of had a lot of movement last week, and what I recommend is finding a, a, a entry that works, not having FOMO, right? Not saying, "Hey, okay." I'm going to just get in because it's buying. I'm going to just get in because it's selling. Nah, respect your analysis and run the play. You feel me? So if you guys want any more information, you want more setups, you want more value, go to pimpinandeasy.com, lock in with the boot camp, join our free profit channel. We do giveaways for Sway Funded. Also subscribe to our YouTube page. All right? So... We appreciate you for locking in. We'll see you next time on PippinAndEasy.com.